So that's an experience, that's a movement, so that's time. Is it, it, it's a, before we got up to speed and then when we got well, up to speed. Well, certainly, certainly, because we are focused in your time-space reality. You are the leading edge of thought. We have never said that we are timeless. We have right. said that we are the non-physical basis of that which you are, but you are the extension of that which we are. And so as we focus through you into your time-space reality, we experience time and space through your experience. But the difference between the way we see it and the way you see it is we never feel shortage of time right. and we never feel shortage of space and we never feel shortage of resources we see it as a smorgasbord that causes an expansion not a shrinkage when someone gets an idea we don't see it as a using up ideas we see it as an adding to the pool of ideas when someone spends a dollar we don't see it as a shrinking of the economy we see it as an adding to the economy when you in your selfish nature build your magnificent home we don't see it as a squandering of resources we see it as an expansion of resources because if you're not asking nothing is expanding and when you are asking it is expanding you see that's why when the human finds lack somewhere, it feels awful in your belly because you're choosing a thought that is inaccurate according to your broader view.